Polia said prior to the commencement of any project work, a significant portion of the socio-economic infrastructure and business benefits agreed for the people must first be delivered, and services like health education, transport, local content and business opportunities must be properly articulated as compulsory requirements. The elk antelope gas field in the Gulf province bears immeasurable potential in contributing to the country's gas industry. It's a people's gas. It's a people's resource. It is theirs, as simple as that. The leader indicated that local consideration and participation must be included in all aspects of the project, including ownership of the LNG pipe, LNG processing plants, LNG transportation, including shipment and the petrochemical industry. Recently, Gulf landowners threatened to close down the proposed plant site following statements by Prime Minister Peter O'Neill, who supported plans by developers to pipe out gas from the area through the merging of pipelines with the existing PNG LNG project project which sources gas from Hela province. The opposition leader supports the landowners by objecting to the proposed merge, saying keeping the two gas projects separate allows for more investments and competition. Venice Tonight, National MTV News.